So we are in the middle of redecorating our playroom slash schoolroom. So I wanted to order a few things that would be perfect for the kids' kitchen, the little puppet stand, and um, just a few little fun things that I wanted to add to it. So our box came in and I wanted to show you guys what we have. So I was super excited about getting this box because I knew it, the things that I ordered would go perfect in the playroom slash school room. Because as I said in a post on Instagram, I wanted the playroom to be a place where they could all come together because each kid has their own setup of toys in your room, but I wanted the playroom to be a place that they can come together to play together. So not only did I want the playroom to be fun and engaging, but I also wanted it to be a schoolroom. So I am still working on the setup and getting it prepared for our after video. And if you look at the before video, it's everything is everywhere. So I wanted to show you guys what we ordered. This is for the grocery store because we have a little grocery store up there grocery store slash lemonade stand and it's by Melissa and Doug. So I love it that it's a multitasking toy. So these are gonna go in the grocery store and then it also has a little apron inside. I'm gonna take it out. So I thought this was really cute. When I saw it, I knew I wanted to have it for their grocery store. So the grocery store clerk will have a little apron to wear. This is super cute. It says, happy every day, you smile, I smile. So that's a little cute. And the owl is actually, I love owls, and I actually have a few on Daniela's wall. And I will give you a tour of her room one day. And then we have other little things that will go in our grocery store as well as the shopping cart or the mini shopping cart. The next thing I got were the chef aprons. Now the kitchen, the kitchen does not did not come with aprons, so I thought it would be a cute idea to buy aprons for their kitchen so that when they're pretend baking, they could put on their little baker's hat and add their apron. And this would be a whole lot of fun for them, hours and hours of fun. So I got that, and there are three in here, so it's perfect number for the number of kids we have right now. Another thing I got were the pots and there's a little pretend burner for the stove. And then there's little cooking utensils, spoons, spatulas, all in that set. And lastly, we have, this is the thing that I'm most excited about. So I wanted the kids to have puppets. But when I was looking at Amazon, I thought, ooh, it would be a cool idea if we made our own puppets. So we have all of the things that we need to make our own puppets. So I'm gonna make this one of our crafts that we do on a Saturday. And it comes with material for six puppets. And then we have the different eyes, nose, little hands, everything that we need to make our cute little puppets. So this is gonna be a great Saturday arts and craft thing for us to do. And if you want to find this, you can find it on Amazon and then the instructions are on this side, just to give you an idea of what you can do with it and what you can make with it. And the other thing that I wanted to show you guys that I ordered were placemats. Now for me, we actually had a little four seater table that we had downstairs, but when I was trying to decide what I wanted for the playroom slash schoolroom, I decided to move that table upstairs. So we had to set up the family table, which seats six, actually it can seat seven, six to seven people because we have a bench. So I wanted to find little placemats for the kids and I am always thinking multi-purpose. And what I mean by that is, Yes, I want placemats for them. I want them to be cute, but I also wanted them to have something that they look at it at every meal. So something that they could also learn from. So these, this one is um, use good manners and it has a different wording for good manners, but 
They also have the opposite side. And here you have the states on that side. Solar system on this side. Alphabet on that side. World map. Numbers. Shapes. And the different flags for the different countries. Now, um, United States of America flag is in the center, of course. But the focus that I wanted to um, discuss with the placemats is multi-purpose. They can look at it to learn from. They can look at something interesting. And I keep the mess off of the table. Less cleaning because we have, sorry, we have four kids ranging in ages eight months up to age 10. So the placemats can be used by each kid because for my little, my two-year-old, he can, he's learning his letters and his numbers as well as his shapes and colors. So um, he can use that. And then my seven and 10-year-old are learning about states and flags, solar systems. So it's, they are multi-purpose for whatever age you have. So I wanted to pop on to unbox these things and show you what we got in new. I am excited to show you the new playroom. I will be posting a before and after video so that you can see all of the changes that we made to our playroom slash schoolroom. All right, mommysters, have a great day.